All right, what is going on? We are back with another one. Um, yeah, we're going to be picking up from where we left off in the last one there. And we actually ended up making it to an area I've never, I've never been to before. Or at least um, in the, during the first playthrough there. But uh, anyways, we're going to be picking up from here. And if you like what you see, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, consider hitting that subscribe button as well. Um, okay. All right. Let's, uh, yeah, let's get moving here. All right. Okay. Yeah, dude, I don't, yeah, dude, I've never been here at all. Oh, okay. So this is the shrine of a deer. Oh, okay, this is good. I, I'm pretty sure we're going to need this for the the ending that we want anyways. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I guess I guess that was it. I thought this was yeah, I thought this was going to be a big area. Right, okay. All right, okay. Yeah, I guess we'll get out of here. Actually no. Yeah, we don't we don't have to go back. We can we can go back this way. <laughs> I don't know why, dude. I find that I find that so funny. Yeah, this is where we... Yeah, we fought this guy right here in the last one there. Oh my goodness, man. I had... <laughs> wow, dude. I, I didn't know. I didn't know I had a seed here. Oh, buddy, you hold on one second here. Wait a minute, bro. Doesn't this, um... Yeah, I think this leads back around here. Um... I don't know. Whatever. Well, yeah, let's check out over here. Yeah, I was just gonna go the other way. Oh, damn. What the frick, dude? How the hell did you, you shoot through that? I 
All right, damn, dude. Thank you. There we go. Yeah, dude, didn't we already grab that item? Oh, whoa. Yeah, I could have swore we already grabbed that item. Hmm. Yo, a crushing gaze. Is that a is that a weapon? It is a strength, radiance, and infernal weapon. Damn, not, uh, yeah, not bad. Carry a night stop. Yeah, that's not for us though. So. Yeah, dude, I guess I wasn't here. I don't know, maybe maybe I'm getting this mixed up with the other playthrough. Oh yeah, okay, okay. We gotta we gotta go up top though. I uh yeah, I remember where we are. Damn, dude. Oh, dude. Oh my goodness, man. Fuck, dude. I thought I was gonna die. We got a chest over here too. Okay, good. There was at least a point to coming up here. Actually, no, dude, the, the item's not going to mean too much. I have a uh, random loot on anyways. <laughs> oh, dude, you got to be kidding me. This, this, this looks like a fucking breakable wall. 
All right, damn, yeah, I guess not. Oh, dude, you can't even go back, eh? All right, okay, yeah, I guess we got no choice but to go this way. Damn grenade guy. Dude, he's got a freaking... He's got a soul, too, eh? Oh, shit. Oh, my goodness, dude. Okay, this is... uh, Yeah, this is not good. <laughs> Fuck, man. Nice try, though. fucking guys right there. I actually think the fight with the Light Reaper is right here. Um, I don't know if it's gonna be the same, but... Oh, damn. Here we go. We're gonna have to die again. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'll fucking... I'll try and kill him, though. Oh, wow, dude. Dude, that was I fucking rolled. What the heck was that? Give me that trap. No, oh, whatever. Way too early. Okay, not doing too bad, but... Yeah, 
Let's see, at least uh, he didn't get hit that time. Oh, dude, that actually does good damage, eh? was a crazy combo. Damn, we almost got him halfway though. Damn, you guys really brought me all the way back here, eh? Yeah, so getting back there shouldn't uh, shouldn't be too tough. We're just gonna go down this way instead here. All right, dude, what the heck are you doing, man? Okay, yeah, I showed this in the last episode as well, but this here, you see how the flame flickers on the top? Yeah, this is a moth or a mimic or whatever. Oh, he fucking, he tried. Damn, dude, wow. Yeah, see, once he kills you, he's gone, and then you just kind of keep going. Yeah, you, you end up in, a, in the real fight with him much, uh, much later. downside is we got to get rid of these guys again here
Damn. Uh, you know what? Yeah, let me let me switch over here. Oh damn! Look at all the fucking guys, man. Yeah, like I was saying in the other one, um, yeah, the Umbro density, that seems to be, or the density upgrade or whatever, seems to really, really be in effect in Umbro here. <laughs> Look at his weapon. Damn. Oh damn. Yeah, we gotta be, we gotta be careful here, man. This is where Yeah, Umbro Umbro can give you some problems here. Yeah, dude, honestly, this fucking, this spell right here is so freaking good. It, get it gets rid of all your status ailments, everything like that, not to mention it heals you, so. Oh, that's a, oh yeah, that's right, a plus 10. Damn, our lamp bear guy is over here, you know, let, yeah, let's go, let's go get rid of him. Oh, shit. Damn, dude. Okay, everybody chill out. Really, dude, you should have freaking ate that. Dude, how in the hell can I hit you? Yeah, I get no stagger either. Well, def definitely not enough. got a, a fully upgraded umbro catalyst or whatever yeah i've been uh, i've been wanting to try try that out so oh shit eh okay fuck off with that man that that you guys need to nerf that big time
right, there we go. Yeah, you gotta be careful, man. That, uh, I don't get why it hits so hard, because they shoot such a barrage of them, they should be way weaker. I don't know, just my, just my opinion, though. Thank you. All right. Okay. Yeah. There's. Uh. Yeah. We don't. We don't have anything over there. Okay, perfect. Yeah, it's the same as uh, my other playthrough. Yeah, that's the glass shard. We never ended up uh, fully fixing the mirror either. So if I can, I would like to do that as well. Oh, said a wooden dark uh, crusader cross eh? and they only gave me one so that's obviously not a weapon damn I wonder I wonder what that's for Damn, you guys. Oh, dude. Normally I wouldn't bother, but... You never... Oh, yeah, you see what I mean? You know, you never know what you're gonna get. Especially with this modifier on. Now, I did want to take a look at the weapon here. No, that's not it. Oh damn. Yeah, it's only it's only a strength weapon. Oh. Yeah, this is a pretty good inferno weapon. I should uh I might actually use this on my other character. Okay, you know, before I go any further here, yeah, let me let me go back to the bridge. And yeah, I want to I want to go free that other girl from the from her cell there or whatever. Yeah, we we still have her sitting in there. Several a noble knight and most devout follower of Our Lady, canonized after he sacrificed himself to help show the hallowed sentinels what was necessary for the greater good. Many have given their lives to sustain the beacons, but Latimer was the first, and remains one of our most venerated figures. Our holy work continues, Lamp. Let Arius's will be done. All 
Alright, okay, there we go. I think there is, um, I think there's four pieces in total. I don't know, there might, there might be three, I don't know, but... Yeah, like I said, I wanna want to see if I can get that done. Yeah, for this lady here, you are gonna want to do it sooner than later. Because um yeah, she does uh she does pop up in a couple different spots in the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, all right, let's start unlocking the cell here. This, uh, this should be the last one right here, but I just got to remember. Okay, no, I can pull this over here. They just gave me a freaking purifying bomb. I could have sworn I'm, I'm uh, I should have gotten a key there. All right, okay, yeah. Let me let me go see here. Yeah, dude, that's uh, yeah, that's kind of weird. Oh look, I, <laughs> I don't know man, it said I picked up a freaking purifying bomb, but uh, yeah, whatever, we, we got the item. <laughs> Alright, okay, so I believe that should be it. Okay, I know who this is. That lady from the swamp. Ah, good to see you didn't lose your head. Though you might wish you had. If you spend too long listening to the nonsense spouted by some people around here. I didn't introduce myself. I'm Kukajen of the Envenomed. The finest mercenary company to ever grace the plains of Yisugen. At one time. Like I said, I owe you. And from what I hear... You've got no small amount of bloody work ahead of you. So, 
when there's fighting to be done, feel free to call on me and I'll be there. And for a smaller fee than I usually charge. You didn't expect me to put my neck on the line for free, did you? I'm grateful, but I'm not an idiot. <laughs> okay. I help you. You pay me. We stay friends. It's simple. Just be sure to make good on your end of the bargain. If you don't, that would complicate things. And neither of us wants that. I help you. Just okay, be sure to all make right. good on yeah, well, um, yeah, in the last one there, I never ended up saving her. I actually broke the statue, so. Good thing I've got thick, sturdy boots, because uh, crossing some parts of that burning ruin they call Lower Calrath is like walking on hot coals. Still, yeah, when you grow up in Perdam, you quickly learn what true heat is. I've never been too fond of fire. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Perdamish Crusades, and there was one about what the Dark Crusaders did to every man, woman, and child in one small village. <sighs> that left an impression. They may worship Aureus, but it's clear as day why Judge Cleric parted ways with the Church of Orion Radiance. While the beacon should remain your most pressing task, I would have you perform another for me concurrently. Seek out and return to me the items which stand as proof of the hallowed sentinel's heretical deviations and practices. For only in the study of such can we hope to turn them towards the true light of Aureus. This land is overflowing with sin, so I expect this undertaking to offer you little difficulty. Also, say nothing of this to Pieta or the Fidelis captain. They are already conflicted. Troubling them further only endangers them and our mission. All right, well, we already have a few of those to hand in, so... While even the handling of such items is objectionable, all facets of this heterodoxy must be exposed. While even the handling of such items is objectionable, all facets of this heterodoxy must be. While even the handling of such items is objectionable, oh my goodness, all man. facets of this heterodoxy really gonna say the must same be. Thing every time, eh? Two fellow crusaders accompanied me to Mornstead. One, a paladin who sacrificed himself to facilitate your resurrection. The other, a harrower who revealed herself to be an apostate and thief. When she stole the apparatus with which I am able to converse with the Council of Overseers. An apparatus I would see returned to me by your hands. Harrower Dervla can be found in the tenebrous bowels of the mine. A fitting place for one who has turned her back on Aureus Light. Whatever poisonous lies Derva may spit at you, heed them not. For they are nothing but the foul blasphemies of a fallen knave. Lower Kalrath has long been a flame-ravaged ruin, but evidence of its former inhabitants' blasphemous beliefs can still be found amidst the ash and rubble. So should you feel any sorrow at such devastation, divest yourself of it, for it is unwarranted. Damn, dude, we got more, eh? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Vanguards are well-versed in infiltrating secluded and hostile territories, and Mornstead is certainly both. Let the presence of this rosary serve as a reminder to you that wherever sin may fester, it will always be found and expunged by the Dark Crusaders. You'll serve a higher purpose, Crusader. To strive in darkness. All right, okay. Light. There we go. Yeah, we had a we had a bunch of stuff to give him. And the lady he was talking about or Durwa or Durla or whatever. Yeah, that's that's another area I didn't I didn't end up going to on my first uh playthrough there. So we'll we'll definitely be doing that.
Okay, so I'm pretty sure I should have a mini boss fight here. Oh yeah, that's right, okay. Yeah, we, we gotta get rid of all these here. Oh my goodness, man. Alright, okay, now we can actually fight her here. Why do you keep doing that? All right, there we go. Easy peasy. Yeah, we're not even not even gonna bother putting down a seed here. Yeah, just want to make sure there's nothing else here. Yeah, norm normally you'd get a ring back here, but oh, yo, that's even better. Nice. <laughs> oh man, fuck, you're getting flattened right to the ground. Yeah, buddy, I don't think so. Oh yeah, that's right, okay. Yeah, it'll be it'll be a little bit before we're able to open that up. Dude, are you kidding me? Yo, he took my whole damn heal. Whatever, we're, yeah, we're good to go. Oh, dang. I actually got him in one hit, eh? Freaking goodness, man. Oh, dude. Damn, Woo. Damn that, yeah, that, that one got me pretty good.
Yeah, like I said before, the best thing about this man is, um, yeah, the fact that it removes all the status effects or whatever. Are you fucking, wait, you see that man, he fucking, oh, dude. He tried that shit again. Hey, now we just need three more, I think. Oh shit, you know what? Okay, this, uh, yeah, this should be a pretty good spot to put a seed. Yeah, I think we'll, uh, we'll keep putting it into Radiance until we hit 50. And then, yeah, we'll do Vitality and Strength after that. Okay, so we're gonna have to go umbral there. Um, yeah, let me let me go up here first then. Yeah. Oh, dude! Hey, chill out, man. He <laughs> fucking just sitting up there. He was looking at me. Oh, come on, man. I wanted I wanted to see how much I was going to do. Turning. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. That's too bad for you, though. Goodness, man, you guys stop doing that shit. Uh, oh my goodness, dude, unfucking believable. Alright, okay. Yeah, I think that's it for up here.
but okay, from what I remember, this little area right here, when you hop down here, it can be a little, little dangerous here. These fucking guys. Oh damn, I don't even know how I hit him. Okay, you know what? Let me. Uh, yeah, I was gonna reset the timer, but you know what? No, we'll we'll uh, we'll be all right. Dude, that was weak, man. So if it hits anything, it doesn't even go through, eh? Six hundred. Okay, not too bad. Oh shit, dude. Look at this guy. Really, buddy? Oh, damn. He didn't even get knocked off. Really? Come on, man. Why, why would you lock onto him? Okay, now we'll, uh, yeah, we'll reset it now. I don't know, I mean, on my first playthrough, I really, I wasn't really a fan of Umbral, but as you play more and more, it's actually, uh, pretty good. Oh, damn. Um, okay, give me a second here. Yeah, the last thing you want is for these guys to end up knocking you down. Oh, nice. Okay, good. Yeah, we're going to activate this here, and then we're going to... Oh, what do we got? Oh, the map. Yeah, we're, we're going to go... We're going to go right back, though. Yeah, dude, because there is, uh, there is quite a bit to this area here. Well, at least on the bottom. Like, you end up going up top over there, too, but... Yeah, you're going to have to go through another area to get to, uh, uh, to get to you. There's an even bigger area <laughs> in this area. <laughs> Damn. 
below you. Damn, dude. Look, I could hear somebody walking on the wood. Run off like this. I know it's not easy, but it can be a frightening place at times, so I want to give you something very special I've had since I was a little girl. When I used to get scared, I'd hold it very, very tightly, and that's when it would reveal its magic to me. And I'd know there was no need to be afraid. So the next time you get scared, I want you to be a brave girl and do the same thing. Understand? There's nothing to be afraid of, Elian. I promise. Oh, so this is where I got the odd stone. Yeah, you gotta you gotta give that to Pieta. Oh, look who else is here. I'd heard things in Mornstead were bad, but this centuries of madness and slaughter, atrocity upon atrocity committed by man and Rogar alike. If all this really resulted from the presence of the rune. Then, whatever boons it might offer, don't forget that lamp is a burden. But it's your burden, so bear it. Never turn to someone else to carry it for you. Whatever boon, but it's okay, your burden. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Never turn. Okay, you know what? I think we jump back over here, so let me yeah, let me let me head over here. Really dude. Okay, now see, the thing is with the moth or the mimic or whatever, dude, you definitely don't want to get it while you're in Umbro. Because most of the time, like every time I've done it, it, it outright killed me. So. Go, go figure you come after me. Alright, okay. Damn, that was, uh, yeah, that was... <coughs> the fuck? Oh, that was, uh, the trap the dude left there. Wait a sec, dude. How the fuck do you... We got an item over here. Oh. Damn, I didn't even know that way was there.
Oh, damn. We got another one of these guys, eh? All right, buddy. You give me one second here. Oh, shit. And I got him as a... As a lamp bearer, too. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, dude. This is funny. Come on, man. Like, I just... This is the part I hate. Get all these fucking guys here. Pretty freaking hard, bro. Oh, look who we got guarding a freaking item, dude. It's not even important either. Right, okay. Yeah, we're done here. Damn, I think he might. Oh, shit. Yeah, I think he might actually chase me. All right, whatever. A nice man with a little moustache told me he saw the baddies taking Melchior towards the castle, and this was how to get there. And look, I found a helmet. The head that we're in, it fell right out, and it fit perfect. That's a good sign, that is. Melchior said Mornstead were going to be the answer to all our problems. I don't know what problems we had, but Melchior knows us. Yes, she does. He'll sort everything out when I find him. Mm. Blimey, ain't half warm round here, though. The inserts and the fools are getting sleepy. Isn't that right, pal? <laughs> See? <laughs> oh, hand over. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, I did this in the other playthrough. Ooh, that hit the spot. I feel like I could run a million billion miles. No monster better get in me way or it'll be mm, 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 for them. <laughs> okay. Look out, baddies. Melchior, here I come. Look out, baddies. All right, okay. All right, well, we are going to have to end it here. But uh, like usual, that was a ton of fun. And so far, man, the playthrough is going pretty, pretty good. Um, anyways, I hope you enjoyed that. And until the next one, everybody take care and peace out.